Here we go. Thank you for the $5. Benny beats both of these bums. Stop. Thank you for the $5. Here we go. Volk's got next, allegedly. We'll see. Round two. Here we go. Oliveira coming forward. Front kick to the body. Both guys miss. Kick from uh, Makashev gets parried. They clash heads again. Knee from Makashev, knee from Oliveira. Big elbow from Oliveira, but Makashev's got close hips. Oliveira tries to throw him down. He gets him down. Good elbow from Oliveira. But Makashev back up, shooting in against the cage. Thank you very much for the membership. The Doros Kistos, whatever. Thank you very much. Makashev's going to look to just drive Oliveira over himself to the right-hand side here. That was a little bit of a flash takedown from Oliveira there at the start of the round. But Makashev back up and pushing him against the cage. Good knee to the body from Oliveira. Makashev going to try to drag him here. Can't quite get it. Good knee to the body again from Oliveira. Makashev gets double unders. We'll see what he does with it. We'll see. Punch to the body from Oliveira. Should try and dig the face quickly with a punch. Makashev goes for a throw. Oliveira stops it. Nice work, but that's not the end. That's not the end from Makashev. Oliveira gets head position, but Makashev might try outside trip him here. Good elbow from Oliveira. Good knee from Makashev. Knee back from Oliveira. They're back in the center. 324, 323. Teep to the body from Oliveira. Makashev misses. Oliveira misses back. Makashev lands as he goes backwards. Body kick from Oliveira. Big right hand from Oliveira in close. That got Makashev's attention. But he's good. Thank you for the $2. Shut up, dude. Two dollars, Makashev, Oliveira. I'm gonna fucking answer your fucking question. Good shot from Makashev there. That was nice. Oliveira is hesitant to throw because he didn't want to give up his hips. But he's picking his shot. Head kick blocked by Oliveira. Left hand from Oliveira. Makashev partially lands with an open glove. They're more just sort of crowding each other when they're in close like this. Jumping knee, but Oliveira gets dropped by Makashev. I knew it was going to happen eventually after fearing the takedown. Half guard on top for Makashev. Looking for an arm triangle. Oliveira straightened his arm out though. This is reasonably tight, but I don't think good enough with half guard. Oliveira scrambles, but might give up his back. Oh, he's tapped. Fuck. Makashev wins. He wins. Boring fight forever. Dropped him because he's fearing the takedown. Boring fights from now on. That's sad. He tried to scramble, but he ended up giving up side control. Fuck. Wet blanket fests at lightweight. Another division dead, but good stuff from Makashev, man. Good win. Oliveira too hesitant to throw on the feet in round two. Wouldn't let his hands go. Got clipped. There you go. I told you at the start. I told you. I bet I got a feeling he'll clip him on the feet. Boring fights forever. Inbred weight bullies win. Just cut more weight than everyone else. Thank you for the $5 fixed. Now we'll see. Good stuff from Makashev though. Cut more weight than everyone else. Be inbred and just win. You got to do that. That's how it works. And get everything on your terms without fighting any top contenders and get everything in your hometown even though you're not even the fucking champion. Inbred. Your kid's going to have six legs. Thank you for the $2. Who's beating Islam? Um, no one. No one beats him. He's too big. Volk's going to move up. You have a 15 pound weight disadvantage. He's too small. He'll just get beaten. There you go. It was a good fight while it lasted, though. It's all good, though. Got to cut more weight. Got to be too big. Got to be too strong. Oh, he tried to jump fucking knee and got clipped. Went to his back. Oh, well. Thank you for the $2. Who angered the MMA gods today? I don't know. They just got to ruin the sport with these boring fucking inbred fucking cliff dwelling retards. Cut more weight, you know. 
Thank you very much for the $5. I appreciate you. Um, Cope Harder Guru. I'm just saying how it is. Good win from uh, Makashev. You know, AK finally gets a champ again. Um, thank you for the $2. How do you win by knee or punches? No, Oliveira threw a jump knee and got clipped after he landed by a right hand. And then Makashev got the arm triangle afterwards. There you go. Good stuff from uh, Makashev. So, like, Makashev Volk, I guess, is the uh, the big fight, super fight. And then maybe uh, Makashev uh, Dariush, lightweight division, dead. But um, that's good. Good stuff. Thank you for the $2. Fair to say 2-8 was a very disappointing card. I mean, it was good fights, but like the outcomes ruined the sport indefinitely on every single fucking turn. Thank you for the $2. Karpa and Islam are champs. Karpa. Thank you for the two Australian dollars. You know what that means. Good stuff, though. Thank you for the $2. Time for the most boring champ after Habib. I know he'll probably fight once a year as well, but it's all good. Maybe in Australia, we'll see. This actually works out for the UFC perfectly. Thank you for the $2. O'Malley versus Yan saved the card. Yeah, but even a decision on that is kind of staled it a bit, you know? Good win from Makashev. God, he's so thick for the division and tall. Crazy. Can't get him off of you. Thank you for the $2. O'Malley versus Yan saved the card. No, decision kind of iffed it. All right, Habib, it's not your moment, dude. Thank you for the $2. Arman is our only hope. Nah, he's too young. He won't even get there in time. Oh my God, he almost fucking face planted him. Thank you for the two dollars. Charles versus Darius Islam versus Volk next. I don't know. Thank you. What for the first round? I just knew it. Sabah, what it is? Yeah. As soon as he took him down, the strength difference was too much. He's too big for him. I told you Oliver had start of a jump front kick though. We'll see. Thank you for the two dollars. I think the UFC lost me as a fan. No, you just have to deal with it. You know, you can't have fun champs. You know, you have to have grapplers that weight bully their divisions and don't fight other people that are their friends. You know, it's all good though. You just got to make sure you can get past Bobby Green and then you can fight for the belt in your home uh, area as well on all your terms. Jarlin Turner's our only hope. Jarlin Turner got out grappled by Matt Frivola. I'll say no more. Thank you for the membership. Sports ruined. It's all good. We'll have some fun. Maybe Yuri won't lose to Glover. Thank you for the one CHF. Thank you for the 100 rupees. Just want Habib versus Tony would have been. Yeah. How does Islam make 155 though? I don't know how he makes 155. I don't think Dagestanis have dicks and they're losing like a couple pounds of weight from there and adding it to their back. Thank you for the $5. Damn, this hurts. I know it's all good though. I just knew it after the rest of the card went the way it did. I knew this was a, a doomsday for the UFC pay-per-view sales. Good win from Makashev though. Solid performance. Good stand-up uh, patience as well. The first round was pretty even, not even. On the feet, it was like whatever. But um, once Makashev knew he was stronger on top, it like put a mental block in Oliveira's mind not to throw punches. You know what I mean? Don't give it to Habib. Be your own man. Oh, don't give it to fucking Habib, man. You take the fucking belt. Like you fucking rim job him or what, man? Thank you for the five dollars. Lamar Dagestani here is really mad right now. You actually thought, haha, take these five to cope with the sort. Thank you for the five dollars. Pay me money. Yeah, I'll I'll take that. Thank you. Insane submission. Arm triangled him, yeah, after rocking him. So that'd be. No number three. Australia, there you go. That's good. Khabib is on the post-fight interview. Be your own guy. Get this back to Makashev. Get this back to Makashev, dude. Fucking hell. Be your own fucking guy. Here we go. Okay, good. Volkanovsky in the crowd. Where's this short guy? Let him go in. Let him go in. Let him go in. He's coming in. Get Volkanovski in. Okay, this is good. I'm okay with this.
Post I poke Balal unlocked. I don't know. Look at the size difference in Volks in trainers. Oh. Oh, no. Look at the size difference. He's in fucking pumps as well. Oh, no. <laughs> no. He's just too small for this inbred dickless weight cutting bitch. Thank you for the $2. Inbreeding best base for MMA for real. I told you. I'm boxing with the gypsies. I told you. Maybe we'll get Oliveira in Brazil still, though. I watch him lose to Fiziev or something. You know? <laughs> oh. Thank you for the 40 years. Lamb dominates Vault lightweight boring again. Yeah. It just ruins it. But they're they're gonna be happy about it, you know, just based on culture. Thank you. Most impressive thing came out of UFC two eighty was Darius's takedown defense, I guess so. But Gamrot ain't the size of Makashev with the extra ten pounds of muscle, you know? It's all good. You hate Muslim people. Islam and Khabib, the two Caucasian white people, are both Muslim. You're racist. Thank you for your stupidity. Yan got robbed. Yeah, that stings it. But it's all good, man. It's all good. Makashev wins. Fuck! Oliveira got back up in the first. Landed some up kicks. Went for a triangle. Just couldn't keep him off of him when it came to it. All the wrong guys won. I know. Uh, he wants to fight again. Thank you for the $5. Did you notice Islam was instantly updated to five stars on UFC 4? Getting tired of the UFC inbred bias. Because he landed a punch on Oliveira and dropped him for a second, dude. It's obvious. Thank you for the $2. I want to see Jack Della wreck Islam. I mean, he's a welterweight, dude. Okay, like Islam ain't going to fight in his weight division. He's Dagestani. Wait, he's already updated to the five-star club. Wait. How is he already updated to the Five Star Club? The fight's just happened. He's been updated already. Striking to five stars now. How the fuck did they know? I mean, they just type it in after, I guess. But wow, that's fucking quick. Like, they're like... <laughs> Hey, five stars. Tell him. Tell him he's five. <laughs> Just waiting there at their keyboards, ready to type it in. Thank you for the 40 rupees. If Islam can make 155, one can't Colby, though. Because Colby is a pace setter of a fighter. He can't be the big weight bully. He's not a muscle-bound, grappling, like, weight bully, strength-based guy. He's a pace setter. If you want to set a pace, you can't cut that much weight. Simple as that. Five-star club, eat a jury, yeah, I know. It's what a shame for the sport. Like, the sport's going to die out eventually. But, you know, maybe there'll be an era soon where boring, nameless fucking people that let other champions speak for them that are already retired, you know, become champion. And we'll see. Good stuff. <laughs>